fuck. You guys wouldn't believe what just fucking happened. I just got fucking jumped outside this Chevron store, guys. I'm walking up to this store. Plast, I rock, there was this truck. Uh, Suburban, or Tahoe or something parked right here. And I walked up and the two guys yelled out, what you doing, what you talking about, or something. And then they all jumped out of the car and I was fighting with them right here. There was four of them on me, kicking and punching me right here. The license plate number was JAE570. Hey Eric, hey Noli D, no I'm not okay, I just got jumped. I wasn't filming, I walked up to the store, four or five dudes jumped out of this Tahoe and just started punching and kicking me on the, right here. I was fighting with them, the lady, the clerk came out with a bat and had to get them off of me. I was down on the ground right here, getting kicked and punched. The vehicle they were, uh, JAE 570 was the license plate number. And they were trying to fucking kill me. I didn't have my knife on me, guys. And it's probably good. They were young guys, 16, 17, 18 years old. And I'm telling you what, I've been in that situation before and I'm glad I didn't have my knife. Because I, I had every right to use it and I would have fucking stuck the motherfuckers bad. They would have been hurt bad. So, yeah. Little bit of drama on the way home, guys. I don't expect APD to fucking help me. But their license plate number was JAE 570. It was uh, like five young individuals in a car. And I don't call the cops. I'm gonna see them around again. But I'm gonna stay live till I get home because they left and I don't have anything with me. So I'm gonna try to make it home. I don't have a weapon on me. But I just got jumped just for no reason. Those kids, those guys just jumped out of the fucking car and jumped me. Started kicking and punching the fucking shit out of me. JAE 570, it was like a beige, uh, about a 2010 Tahoe four-door. JAE 570 was a license plate, quite possibly could have been stolen. But I'm gonna have to find a weapon here on the road or something, guys. If I see them again, they're gonna, they're gonna try and kill me. I don't know if it has enough battery left here. I just want to get home. And I knew I should have had that. I knew I should have had it with me. I oh, appreciate you guys. Yeah, they, they almost, I was down on the ground. They were fucking kicking and punching me in the fucking head. Uh, when I fell, kind of fell to the ground, I covered up, and all four or five of them were over me, kicking and punching me. The lady, the clerk came outside with the bat, actually, and I was, I, I was trying to get, ask the lady, let me see that bat, let me have that bat, and they all jumped back in their cars and took off. They were all fucking just running at me, trying to throw punches. It's okay, guys. It's happened to me before on these streets. They made a big fucking mistake. Because I don't call the fucking cops. 
and I'm gonna remember their fucking face too. So they probably should have killed me. Catch up with these comments, guys. I'm just jacked up right now. Yeah, I saw their faces, Vet Tech Kimmy. Hey, it's Jason. Chuck Bronson hit me. Thanks. Thanks, Chuck. Chuck Bronson's a good auditor. He's out there doing the damn thing, so. Yeah. I just pretty, uh, pretty shook up there, guys. I was holding my own as best I could against all four punks, but I was kind of pretty much overwhelmed there. And it just came out of the blue. I didn't expect them to jump out of the car and come at me like that. And I'm not gonna call APD. So if APD is listening, the license plate number was JAE570. If you guys don't catch them and I see them again, I'm gonna fucking kill them. Just so you know. Because they were tar definitely trying to kill me. And I'm not gonna fucking hesitate. So just so you know, if you have a few dead teenagers in your street somewhere, you'll know who did it. Because I don't depend on you fucking pigs for protection at all. You guys might, not you guys, but this public here. So they weren't protecting me then. Of course, you know, you think, oh, how can you expect them to be there? Well, thing is, I ain't gonna follow up on it, I bet. Just like the guard case. So if they're gonna let the guard assault me. Oh, I got 56 people in here. I appreciate your support, guys. I just wanna try and make it home. I just wanna try and make it home safe. I can tell you right now, guys, I'm not going out again without a weapon in my pocket. And if APD is listening, their license plate number was JAE 570 at Chevron downtown. They left there about 20 minutes ago. So who knows where they're at now. But I hope you guys can catch them. It'd probably be better for them. Because I am going to be packing whenever I go out now. I'm going to get some mace too. Appreciate your support guys. I'm trying to get a job so I can keep cop watching. Survive. If I can survive through next month, I'll be good. I think I'll be okay. So yeah, I just want to get home safe. I didn't expect that to happen. Get the crowd with me here, my YouTube family. Yeah, it was crazy guys. That lady clerk came out with a bat and had to, she was kind of half-assedly getting them off me. They just stayed there kicking and punching me on the back of my head and while I was down on the ground and she was kind of screaming at them, get off them, get off them. And they just kept punching and kicking me. And then I finally got up and then I saw she had a bat and I was trying to ask her, give me the bat, give me that bat as they were jumping back into their car. Because I was going to fucking go off on that motherfucking car. I don't care whose it was at that time. 
<laughs> I wish I had a knife. If I had my knife on me, I would have popped the tires and they wouldn't have went anywhere. But I don't think they realized who they were fucking with. Because I call it the Walmart factor. The Walmart principle. When you go into Walmart, you always see somebody's, you know, it's like almost all the time. So in this small city, and I've lived here long enough, you're always gonna see them again. Trust me. Hey. This is them guys. Bro, give me the wallet. Give me the wallet right now. Them guys, can you call APD 786-8900? They're trying to rob me. your face bro. Care, bro yeah, yeah. I guess you don't I know Bro, what is the fuck? Oh, nigga. Oh, 